హలో ఎవ్రీ వన్ దిస్ ఇస్ ప్రశాంత్ వెల్కమ్ టు మై ఛానల్ సో ఎస్టర్డే వీ సా అబౌట్ అవుట్ దిస్ అవుట్ టు సెట్అప్ ద ఇన్స్టలేషన్ ఆఫ్ ద సాఫ్ట్వేర్ రైట్ సో టుడే వీఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు సీ ద ఫస్ట్ కోడింగ్ రౌండ్ ఓకే సో ఐఎమ్ గోయింగ్ టు క్రియేట్ న్యూ ఫైల్ సో ఇన్ దిస్ వీఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు సీ ద పైథాన్ వేరియబుల్స్ అండ్ అదర్ మెథడ్స్ ఓకే సో ఫస్ట్ ఆఫ్ ఆల్ ఇన్ వేరియబుల్స్ హౌ మెనీ వేరియబుల్స్ వీ వీట్ నోన్ ఇస్ ఫోర్ వేరియబుల్స్ వీ ఇంటు నో ఓకే ఫస్ట్ ఆన్ ఇస్ స్ట్రింగ్ సో వాట్ ఇస్ స్ట్రింగ్ స్ట్రింగ్స్ ఇస్ కలెక్షన్ ఆఫ్ టెక్స్ట్ సపోజ్ ఐ వాంట్ టు స్టోర్ మై నేమ్ సో నేమ్ ఇస్ అ టెక్స్ట్ రైట్ సో ఐ ఆమ్ గోయింగ్ టు గివ్ దిస్ ఇస్ అ స్ట్రింగ్ సో ఇట్స్ అ టెక్స్ట్ దెన్ ఇఫ్ యూ వాంట్ టు స్టోర్ ద నంబర్స్ హౌ టు స్టోర్ ద నంబర్స్ సో యూ కెన్ సే ఎగ్జాంపుల్ లైక్ ఐ వాంట్ టు స్టోర్ ద సాలరీ మీన్స్ ద న్యూమరికల్ వాల్యూ ఓకే సో దిస్ ఇస్ కాల్డ్ ఇండీజర్ ఇస్ అ నంబర్ సపోజ్ సమ్టైమ్స్ యూ ఎంట్ నో స్టోర్ ద డెసిమల్ వాల్యూస్ so how to store that like in trust equal to some was told dot 50 so this is a float we call as a float but it stores the decimal value next one is a boolean okay in boolean we have two things true or false suppose flag i'm storing like a true okay so what is the other option is false so in this first letter is capital okay this we call as a boolean values okay so this name this salary and variable name we can user can give any name okay so i'm giving a name salary like that okay so now i'm going to print and show you i'm going to print the name and all the all the fields like like printing the salary printing the interest printing the flag so how to run it last class i show you python variable what is the file name variable dot py see this it is four value printed next one we are going to see the data type there are so many data types but you don't want to know everything so uh, main thing is list okay list is a group of variables so if you want to store more than one variable means we can use a list okay suppose i want to store all the states names okay so i am you want to give a square bracket so this is string so i can give a string like delhi mumbai and chennai so i am storing this three states in a single variable the variable name is called states so how to use this so we need to use the print print so what is variable name states we need to provide the index so generally index starts from zero that means delhi is zero mumbai is one chennai is two so if i give one means which one will print mumbai right okay same suppose i want to add any other things means i want to give variable name dot append suppose i want to add bangalore okay see this added a bangalore so if i how to print the bangalore so bangalore is number 3 because delhi is 0 mumbai 1 2 and 3 so states as 3 okay now we can print and see it see this mumbai is in 2 bangalore is like mumbai is in 1 and bangalore is in 2 it's a in index okay next one is tuples so tuples also similar to this but what is the different means this is order and we can update okay same tuple also order that means it will store in order okay so right now i'm giving the nums equal to i'm storing this time i'm storing numbers this is in circle bracket like 2 5 8 12 15 okay this is order but what is the difference means this is non changeable okay so how to print this this also you want to go in a index manner nums of 3 so in 3 means which one will print a 0 1 2 3 so it will print the 12 the last one is dictionary so dictionary if you study about java or other languages we have, we have a map so this is distinctly also similar to map suppose i want to store the student one means how to store the student like 
I want to store the you want to use a curly bracket first in this key is I'm giving it as a name and name is Ravi and I'm giving the classes this is a, I'm giving a fifth standard five so then I'm going to give a like pass I'm going to give true so this are the name is the key and Ravi is the value and class is the key phi is the value pass is the key and true is the value this is the boolean this is the integer this is an integer okay so how to use this means we can use student first variable name then square bracket you want to give the key so which key oppose you want the class means you want to provide the class so right now i'm going to run this see here it's printed the file suppose you want the name of the student means you want to give it that name key now see this it's printed the ravi and previous tuple sensor stall is displayed okay so these are the basics of variables and the data types we want to know and then the small thing is we want to know basic of arithmetic operator okay so basic uh, like addition or subtraction. Before that, I want to store two numbers. One is a and b equal to fifty-six something. Okay. So one is addition. Now what is addition? Sub you know the plus icon, right? For subtraction, we have subtraction icon. For multiplication, we have a into b, and for division, we have a divided by b. And another main one is module A modulo B. So I'm going to print all the values. So one is add. So I'm going to give print five times. So I'm going to print all the five values. So you can ask what is the difference between division and module in division it will give the quotient value suppose you are dividing 5 divided by 2 means it will give a result as 2 okay suppose what is the module means if i doing 5 modulo 2 means it will give the 1 that is this modulo will give the remainder dividend will give the quotient value that is the only difference so i'm going to terminal so I'm opening the old terminal. So I'm going to run again. See this? It's printed all the values. Okay. So these are the basic operators we want to know. Okay. So if you have any doubt on this one, please comment me. I will provide this key like keyword in the Word document and share that document in the description. And every day, whatever the code I'm typing, I'm going to place in the document only. So you can use it. If you have raised any issues, please put me in the comment. Thanks for joining. If you like the video, please like and share to your friends.